that if a man has a vision, he can cast it and people will catch it. And you can cast it, animals too will catch it. Since you don't talk to animals, they can't hear your language, English. You use pictures. That's what God showed this guy. Abraham's grandson. So now this guy took all the spotted animals and vanished, went very far, put boundary between him and Jacob. You must not cross this boundary. And God said, get up, paint all the trees spotted. Paint the buckets where they drink water spotted. Paint all the, even the, everywhere where the, the staff you are using as a shepherd, paint is spotted. If it's possible, show a spotted dress and wear it everywhere the animals turn. Let them be seen spotted. I want to show you the power of vision. I want to show you the power of vision. I want to show you the power of vision. And look at what happened. All the animals started conceiving spotted children, spotted grandchildren, spotted great grandchildren, spotted before we knew it. The man became a multi billionaire. And the ogre came and said, Ah, he got envious. God said, Once he leaves, don't teach him the technology. Let him go first. And he left. He said, Remove all the spotted things you painted, make it one one color. And then all the animals that appear in one, one color. Have you seen it? The size of your vision is the size of your life. The nature of your vision is the nature of your manifestation. The pictures you have within is the reality you are going to have without. And it affects your company. It affects your staff. It affects your family. It affects your children. It affects your church. It affects a nation. Get us a leader that knows how to cast national vision. Nigeria can be changed like this.